Hi, my name's Andrew Wong and I'm a cosplayer. And today I am dressed as Yu Yu Hakusho Toguro. So, there's a cartoon or a Japanese anime called Yu Yu Hakusho and one of the badass bad guys is a guy called Toguro, which is what I'm dressed as today. Sunglasses, blue jeans, he has a crew cut, but I don't want to have a crew cut. Anyhow, as you know, I like to dress as cosplay with my shirt off, and I like to give tips on how to look good with your shirt off when you're playing a cosplayer a character, which is famous for not wearing a shirt, but showing off their physique. And I'm talking about increasing muscle mass and decreasing body fat percentage. And here is my tip for today. Protein. Eat lots of protein. That is very important. As I said before, when you do intensive workouts, the whole point is to micro tear your muscles so that after rest, uh, they repair themselves and become bigger and stronger. But you need protein because protein is the building blocks for muscle and body tissue. So anyhow, you've probably seen the Marvel movie, Captain America. Well, in that movie, the actor who played Captain America, during his training regime, his personal trainer got him to eat lots of protein in the form of lean chicken. He had to eat lean chicken throughout the day to the point whereby he said practically he was ready to throw up and after the filming of Captain America, he was just sick and tired of lean chicken. Because lean chicken, besides the fact that it has low fat and a high percentage of uh, protein in it, is good uh, for absorbing into your body. Another tip is what's called whey powder. So when you make cheese out of milk, you have two products, the curd, uh, which is used to make cheese, and you have this liquid called whey. And what they do is they dehydrate the water out of the way to have whey powder. You get that powder, mix it with water, drink it 30 minutes before a workout and 30 minutes after a workout, and your body absorbs that protein to build muscle. But however, the thing is this. Uh, eating lean chicken, eating lean beef, eating lean salmon, and eating whey powder is probably one of the best forms of protein for building muscle, but it is so expensive. And so I'm going to give you a tip on forms of protein that you can consume to build muscle, but it won't break the budget. Okay, the first thing is peanuts. Peanuts are a good source of protein, plus also they have good carbohydrates. Because that's the thing, it's, to build muscle you need carbohydrates plus protein. And peanuts are cheap, easy to eat, lots of protein, good carbs, lots of vitamins and minerals. The next one I can suggest is eggs. Eggs are an excellent sort of source of protein um, and they can be easily absorbed into the body when you cook it. There are a lot of people whereby they take raw eggs and mix it with say milk and water and then drink it. I, I mean, I used to do that because whenever I don't have time to sit down and cook eggs and then eat it, I'll just get a blender, uh, put some milk or water in there, add the eggs, blend it, and drink it all down. But however, raw eggs are not as good as cooked eggs, because when the eggs are cooked by heat, the protein is more uh, digestible. So, and another thing is, a lot of bodybuilders eat only the white and throw away the yolk. What happens is, although the yolk contains a lot of fat, it is good fat. And also the yolk contains pretty much most of the vitamins and minerals. In fact, an egg contains every single vitamin known to uh, man, except for vitamin C. So the thing is, according to the Heart Foundation, eating eggs is good for you. It's good for the heart, it's good for the body. Plus also, remember I told you about ketosis? whereby when you're trying to get your, your body used to burning fat as a source of energy, by eating the entire egg, the yolk and the white, you're training your body to burn fat as energy. And like I said, the yolk contains most of the vitamins and minerals, whereas with the white contains the, most of the protein. And it's a very, very cheap 
form of protein. So eat your eggs, all of it. And by the way, the old wives tell that you can only have two per day or else it increases your cholesterol. That is a fairy tale. Research has shown that you can eat as many eggs as you want and not worry about getting fat and also increasing your cholesterol. Remember, processed sugars such as cakes, cookies, biscuits, bread, pasta, those are the things that make you fat. And the thing about white flour based products or even rice is that they're empty calories. Same with sugar. You're eating all these calories but there's no protein, vitamins and minerals, fiber or any form of nutrition in it. So eggs is fine. And another one is sardines. If you go to the tin fish section of any supermarket, you've got your tuna, you've got your salmon, you've got your mackerel, a bit pricey. But however, sardines are very, very cheap. Sometimes 50 cents less than a dollar for a tin of sardines. Full of omega-3, which of course is a fatty acid important for brain development and nerve development. And sardines contain a lot of protein. Plus, when you look at it, sardines are at the bottom of the food chain where they eat algae. The higher you go into the food chain, like for example if you eat a shark or say a swordfish or tuna, because they eat smaller fish, um, they're often high in pollutants such as mercury and microplastics, whereas with sardines, bottom of the food chain, they eat algae, less toxins and poisons, still high in protein and omega-3. The next one, especially if you are a vegan or if you're a vegetarian, is beans and legumes. So I love to make a stew and a curry out of things such as uh, chickpeas, red kidney beans, black beans, black eyed peas, green peas, yellow peas, uh, lentils. You buy them either tinned or dried and you can cook them and, and add sauces like tomato sauce or curry powder and make a delicious lentil legume stew. It's full of good carbohydrates, fiber, high in antioxidants, and full of protein. And it's healthy for you. Remember, the important thing is fiber. Like, as people, we need to eat fiber. If we don't eat enough fiber, what happens? We can't go and shit. To put it bluntly, if you don't go to the bathroom with the toilet on a regular basis, you're not getting all of those toxins and dead cells over your body. So remember, if you want protein, but a cheap, reliable source, my suggestion is eggs, peanuts, legumes, and tin sardines. And if you've got enough money, things like uh, salmon, lean chicken, beef, and whey protein powder are good sources, but a bit more expensive. So anyhow, protein, get it into you. That's the way to get lean. <laughs>